Hi, I'm RV Azurin. I'm 25 years old and this is our 2017 Toyota Innova. It is a family car. Um, my dad purchased this last May 2017. We used to own in 2011 Toyota Innova. That was our previous car. Laki ng pagbabago sa itsura niya. Lalo siya naging bulky at mas stick tignan. We use this car every day. Since this is a family car, we often use this in long driving and even in city driving, especially lalo na pag umuulan. Things that I like about this car is number one, it is equipped with a 2.8 diesel engine. Very responsive and powerful enough for a wagon type body. Number two, it is a equipped with a bigger bigger legroom space compared to previous Toyota Innova model. And number three, kahit na lowest variant siya sa Toyota Innova, it is equipped with a with all power features such as power windows, power side mirrors, dual airbags, rear wiper na wala sa previous model na same variant. Another thing that I like about this car is that, is that you have the option of using eco mode or normal mode for city driving and you can choose power mode for long drive that you can use especially in uphills and overtaking purposes. One thing I don't like about this car is that Given na 3 months pa lang sa amin to pero may naririnig na kami squeaking or unwanted noise on the front right end of the car. Na long drive na rin namin to from Manila all the way to Cagayan. Uh, Ulod kami. Sin puno pati mga bagahe. Hindi naman na sacrifice yung ride handling, comfortability, stability, cornering. Okay. I highly recommend this car for your next uh, family car. I I can rate this a 9 over 10. Kasi may squeaking sound eh. Kung wala, 10 over 10. <laughs> <laughs>